Hello, I am Adela. Welcome to my kitchen. I will make garlic baby squid with baked potato wedges in this video. Bursting with flavor and cooked to perfection, this dish is a delicious and wholesome meal that's sure to please. Here's how to create the ideal baked potato wedges. Peel the potatoes and wash them to remove any dirt or debris. Slice the potatoes into quarters, about half inch thick, to create the perfect ratio of crispy skin to fluffy insides. Combine the red paprika, garlic powder, salt, spicy chili seasoning and chopped rosemary in a small bowl. This seasoning mixture will bring out the natural flavors of the potatoes and add subtle spiciness. Dry the potato slices with a paper towel and put them on a baking sheet lined with parchment paper. Sprinkle the potatoes with the seasoning mixture and toss them to coat evenly. This will ensure that each potato slice is bursting with flavor. Add olive oil and mix well to create crispy and flavorful skin during baking. The olive oil will also help the seasoning mixture adhere to the potato slices. Bake the potatoes for 30 to 35 minutes in the oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit until they are fork tender and the skin is crispy. Stay with me to see how easy you can make the tempting garlic baby squid recipe. To begin, finely chop two large garlic cloves and a bunch of fresh parsley. We shall commence by preparing the flavored oil infused with the piquant essence of garlic and parsley that will be utilized to cook the flavorful baby squid. Heat a small skillet over medium heat and gently pour the olive oil. Allow it to warm up before adding the finely minced garlic cloves. Listen to the sizzle and relish the tantalizer aroma as the garlic blends with the oil. Subsequently, add the finely chopped parsley and squeeze the juice from half of a lime. Allow the flavors to blend and set it aside. Next, heat another skillet over medium heat and pour in the olive oil. Add the baby squid and season it with a pinch of salt and pepper. Stir well to blend the ingredients and let the baby squid saute for 2 minutes until it turns translucent. Cover the skillet with a lid and cook for another minute. Uncover the skillet and continue cooking until all the liquid in the pan evaporates. Add two spoonfuls of the aromatic oil and saute for two more minutes until the calamari attains a delightful golden brown color. Be wary of overcooking the baby squid as it will transform it into a rubbery and tough texture. Finish it off by squeezing a dash of lime juice on top. 
I like to serve this tender baby squid's hot, garnish with freshly chopped basil and crispy flavorful baked potatoes wedges. The fusion of flavors is a match made in heaven, crafting an irresistible dish that will leave your taste buds yearning for more. If you like this video recipe, subscribe to my YouTube channel Adela in the Kitchen. If you have questions or suggestions for the next recipes, leave a comment below. I wish you a good appetite!